user interface. It is a on-screen command of a computer. For example, the toolbars of Microsoft Word. So when you look at here, this is the user interface. So what does that mean? Face, you know what face means. So you can understand the face of the computer user and the face of the computer. The face of the computer is this, the monitor. Okay, the whole area that you're looking at is the face of the computer. Now, interface refers to the area between your face and the computer's face. Or to be more precisely, is user interface refers to this area where the toolbars are. Okay. Now, it was not until about 20 years ago we have these icons here. If you want to save something like this, we can go to here and then save. So now this interface allows us to save. Or if you want to cut, we come to the icon here, we go to cut. And these icons are called graphical user interface because they are pictures. So even if you don't speak English language, which means you do not understand these words, you still understand that this icon is for you to use when you need to cut something. So this makes it very easy for people to give the computer the instruction about what you want it to do through this interface. Okay. So these interface are graphical, therefore they are called graphical user interface. And about before we have the GUI, the computer users do not have the convenience of these two bars. So what do they do to instruct the computer to do different types of jobs? The simple ones such as to cut or to save. Well, they have to face a dark screen of the computer and then they have to type lines and lines of instructions to do the job. So if they want to write a letter, they will say, type, hello, how are you on the dark screen? And then they have to type things like this, the command line to tell computer to save what you just typed, hello, my friend. Okay, so they were just to summarize what I have said, uh, interface refers to the area on the computer screen where you can instruct the computer to do some jobs. There were two types of interfaces. One is command line interface, that's in older versions. And the graphical user interface is a later version and it's more convenient. Okay, and another concept you can learn from this video is WIMP. So when Windows invented the graphical user interface, they called it WIMP. So it's a GUI interface developed for PCs. So this whole system, they called it WIMP which is short for Windows Icon Menu and Pointing Device. And it also refers to our use of mouse, cursor, and icon to collectively work to tell the computer what to do without writing the line. So this is what the WIM is all about. Now the last concept that's related is the post WIM. 
that is the the latest technology that allows users to tell computer what to do through the interface so instead of using a mouse cursor or an icon to click the icons we can use finger to type to touch the screen such as in the case of iPad and there were new two new things that the conventional interface cannot do that is to pinch and to rotate now this refers to iPad okay this is the end of the video